Fly Lady Diane here and welcome to day one of our seven day Fly Ladies Routines Challenge. Now, I don't really like calling it a challenge because challenges are something that we think, oh, can we do it? Can we get through it? And I know you can do this. I know you can go for seven days with a routine because I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to hold your hand, pull you through and we've got everybody on board with this challenge, which is fantastic. But I want to really, if, if you can just listen to me with this part and then we'll get started. Your routine is different from everybody else's in the world. All right, I've got my routine. I've got, you know, I've been doing Fly Lady for years. We have new fly babies on board who have, you know, at day two, day three of the 31 baby steps. And yay, that's the best place to start with Fly Lady. I've, don't go looking for other videos right now, but I've got, I walk you through the 31 days of the baby steps. Uh, but what I want you to know is that we all have different routines. And I've said to you with this little experiment that we're doing the next seven days, choose a routine just like what, you don't need to be doing morning routine, evening routine, just choose one thing to work on. That's how Fly Lady started, just one small thing to start on. And it doesn't, I don't want you to be doing my routine. If you saw my morning routine, I've got various stages. You don't need to do that. All we're doing is taking a routine that's gonna help us start off our day or end our day, and we're just gonna be consistent with it. That's what we're learning here. We're learning the process of being consistent. And hopefully you will see that it's not hard work. It seems like a little bit of extra work in the beginning, but it's gonna save you so much time and energy and stress. And that's what we want for you. We want to get rid of all that stress that you're carrying around on your shoulders and in between your ears. Um, now, just a little couple of tips. What is the routine that you're gonna be working on? Think about that. I want you just to grab a pen, piece of paper. Um, if you do the 31 baby steps, you'll know that we, it's very, a great idea is to use sticky notes to remind you, you know, put sticky notes to remind you to do your morning routine or your evening routine. If you've got, you know, if you did the 31 baby steps, you know, we did a little control journal and I hope you're still, uh, you know, adding to that and adding, you know, things that inspire you and putting your routines in there. If, you, if you've already made a control journal, you'll have your morning routine or your evening routine, afternoon routine, whatever you are working on and you can tick things off. That is the main tip for today. You've got to write it down somewhere, whatever your morning routine is, afternoon routine, evening routine, whatever it is you're working on, please write it down somewhere because we've got so much going on, we're not going to remember. If you have it written down on a, a sticky note, you know, staring you in the face every day, it's a good trigger just to do it. And um, if you su subscribe to these videos, you know, I'm, I'm saying I'm not your mother, but if you subscribe to uh, this channel, you'll get these videos into your mailbox every single day. That will be a trigger to you. Team up with a friend, do it that way. But make sure you write down what it is you're working on, because if you don't have a plan, it's not going to happen. It really isn't going to happen. So you've just got to, I mean, don't go looking for other Fly Lady videos right now, just stop here and now. And what is it you're, I mean, what is it you want from this challenge? Because I can lead you through it, but unless you do something, unless you change something, it's not gonna work. So you've got to think right here and now, what is it that my morning routine or my evening routine, afternoon routine is, or you know, what, what is it I want to add? And if you're a brand new fly baby, doing the fly babies, 31 baby steps, you're, you're gonna start off, the first thing that we do is shining your sink every night. You don't need to be doing, you know, shining your sink, looking at your clothes, uh, prepping for tomorrow. Don't worry about all that, you'll get there. Your first priority right now is just shining your sink and make that your routine for the next seven days of the challenge. Uh, if you're a bit further down the line, maybe you want to do 
you know, shining your sink uh, or dressing to shoes or making sure that you walk your dog at a certain time in the morning, you know what you need to have on your routines. I've talked about routines a lot. And if you saw the little video that I did yesterday, uh, I said that personally, I would suggest that if you're working outside of the home, if you are, you know, getting dressed to shoes, because, you, you know, if you, hopefully, if you're working outside the home, you're kind of dressed to shoes when you leave in the morning. That's, you've already got motivation. You, you've got to get to work. So your, your morning routine is probably, um, or some form of morning routine is probably in place. What you will probably uh, want to work on is your evening routine or afternoon routine. And the opposite way, if you are working from home, if you are retired, if you are off sick, if you are at home with the kids, any of those things, if you are within the four walls every day, what I personally suggest is that you work on your morning routine because that just, you know, unless you get your morning routine done, the rest of your day isn't gonna happen. So that's my tip for today. You know, write it down. You know, uh, we can't remember everything, you know, and I'm 49, menopause age, and I really, you know, and there's no shame in it. Um, you know, I used to be able to remember everything, postcodes, telephone numbers, um, you know, of everybody. And now I can't kind of remember what we're having for dinner tonight, but I've got it on my menu plan. I just need to look at it. We, we can't keep all that information in our heads. There's so much going on. You've got your telephone with notifications all the time. So let's keep it simple. And the other thing um, I wanted to say was, don't worry about this challenge because I know when I posted this challenge yesterday, the first thing I noticed that everyone was saying, help, don't know where to start. You know what? I'm, I'm here and all the others are here and we're all working on it together. That's the whole fly the system. We're working together. And I want you to give yourself a pat on the back because you may not have done your routine yet or done anything, but you have recognized that something's got to change. And the only person that can make that change is you. I really want you to do this uh, routine challenge with me because I know how much it helped me. I was living in such a fog and chaos and I came looking for, you know, searching out what could possibly help me. And I found the Fly Lady system and that's what I want for you. And it was a struggle and I've made all the mistakes possible, but I know that by doing these routines, that just gives us, you know, it clears the brain fog and it sets us up and then, you know, we can, really press on with decluttering and menu planning and all of that stuff. So I'm going to keep it short. If you do uh, your morning routine or your evening routine, maybe you're working on both afternoon routine, write in the comments, I did it, you know, go me and give yourself a pat on the shoulder, make yourself a cup of tea, celebrate with a glass of water and let's just do it together, all right? Um, any problems, let me know in the comments, but you know what, it's this, I know I've said it like 3,000 times because I hear it in all my videos. This is not rocket science. Anybody can do it, you know, and if I can do it, you can do it too, all right? It's really, you can do it, just, uh, do you remember that thing that they used to say in the, um, must have been the 90s, that uh, kiss? K-I-S-S, -S -S. Um, keep it simple, sweetie. That's what I want you to remember, just keep your routine simple. If you have not been doing Fly Lady at all, and let be honest here, I don't want you to go from like doing nothing to doing a full-blown morning routine as it's listed on the Fly Lady website. Fly Lady says, keep it simple. We've got to keep it simple. And all we're doing is starting off with this and we'll keep adding every day. Uh, sorry, I'm not, we're not adding something to our morning routine every day. We're just doing this routine, afternoon routine, evening routine, morning routine, and we're being consistent with it for seven days. And then after that, you know, you might want to wait a few more days and then add something else to it. All right, but you can do it. So 
Fly Lady Diane signing off from beautifully sunny Copenhagen today. The Danish weather gods are with us. But I heard on the uh, weather forecast this morning, they are predicting uh, rain and even some snow showers this afternoon, 25th of April. It's madness uh, because I know I tell you a lot that the Danish winter is very long and hard, but normally we kind of go from wearing boots to wearing, you know, flip flops and shorts in the month of April. Um, it's, the warm weather is not here yet. Anyway, that's it for me this time. Fly Lady Diane and I'll see you tomorrow for day two of the challenge. This was day one. Just do what you can and give yourself a pat on the back. Okay, bye for now.